My name is Aaron Chandler and you're watching Coast Chai YouTube channel. The perfect place for theme park news, reviews and vlogs. After all, I've always got roller coasters running through my mind. <laughs> Hey guys, my name is Ghost Shadow Dogs the Bob Bob Theme Park News and welcome to a Theme Park News update from Poulton's Park and Tornado Springs. Now I didn't think I'd be doing another news update. Uh, we did have Fab Fab Family Fun at Lightwater Valley Theme Park um, and all that event and stuff like that. But we do have another Theme Park News update and this is from Tornado Springs. Now this is a uh, image, a construction image on the completion of Storm Chaser and we also have something to share with the Poulton's Park map. 2020 that might give us some clues to color schemes on other parts of the construction site that may not be as finished as the track of storm chaser so let's get started then if you like this video make sure you do give it a like make sure you subscribe to the channel as well it would really mean a lot to me please click the notification bell as well so you never miss a youtube video uh, make sure you share the channel with your friends family and on social media and for now guys let's get into this video so this is all about Tornado Springs. We get closer and closer to the, the middle of May. Obviously, if you didn't know already, Poulton's Park is near Southampton. It's right at the bottom of the country. Uh, so the Tornado Springs opening day would be a big push for me. <laughs> it would be a fantastic trip. Don't get me wrong, because I've never been down south before. Well, I say down south, I mean like that side of the country, I guess. Um, but... This park is definitely on the up. I feel like it's a really good park to visit. Uh, it's mainly geared towards an overall family. So you've got the teens, the kids, the mums, the dads. It's a whole family trip. So they've got a whole range of attractions. They've got something for the thrill seekers like myself and I know a few other people. They've got the family attractions as well. And they've got a mix in this new area for 2020. It's Tornado Springs. We've covered this area. It, it only feels right. It only feels right if we attend the opening day because we've covered this project from the very beginning. From the first teaser poster to the first ride confirmations to the first construction updates. And it only feels right to go to the opening day. So I'll try my best to get out there. Can't promise anything yet, but I'll try and get out there as best I can. But... It gets me even more excited because we've got some finished construction on Storm Ch an overall look on the Storm Chaser. This is from Lawrence Mancy's Twitter, so big shout out to Lawrence Mancy. Uh, big fan of the videos. The Poulton's Park team love the videos. They've always uh, loved the videos. Uh, the engineering team actually got a shout out in one of our construction updates. I can't believe that was months ago. Uh, but here we go on your screen now. Find a bit Aussie. Look at that. That is the finished Storm Chaser. And an overlook of the rest of the area. You can see uh, some of the buildings uh, at far back. Storm Chaser are pretty much completed. And it's just an overall look at the area that needs to be completed. Then I'm going to be putting something on your screen now. Find out with Sorry if the image is a little bit blurred, but this is the map. Now, the map with Tornado Springs attractions on it. Now, like I said before, this gives us clues to attractions that haven't been finished yet and stuff like that for colour schemes and how it looks as the finished product so cyclonates for example you've got the windmills on the top that ride's been finished um i mean do, i mean the, the detail and theming on this swing ride is fantastic storm chase obviously we knew it was going to have like a pretty much like a full gold colour scheme i guess um i mean it's like dusty sandy supports and yellowy goldy tracks so it, we, were, we were around about there. Uh, Owls Auto Academy, you can see you've got the, the blue, green and red cars. Uh, that specifically replaces the Gold Rush Falls attraction uh, that was there. It's a Panning for Gold attraction and a Mini Golf. They had it separate and then for 2007 they brought it together, became Gold Rush Falls. Uh, it's either Gold Rush Falls or Gold River Falls, something like that. Um, that was introduced in 2007, of course that went... Uh, ready for the construction of this as well as the old animal enclosures um, the Rio Grande train that's been given like a bit of a repaint uh, with the red train uh, the trekking tracks is given a bit of a bit of a new look uh, the cars on the trekking tracks if you look very very closely doesn't seem to have changed so I think for a phase two I'd like to see uh, maybe um, like a repaint of the tractors like a phase two uh, just to just Bit of general improvement, bit of general upgrades, because it still kind of looks like a, 
an old classic family tractor ride, not really a themed experience. So I think the theming around the ride looks brilliant, but you just need to change the colour of the, of the tractors maybe. But maybe that's the design they're going for. If, if so, then it's a decent style. It's a very different style. Uh, windmill towers look great. Obviously, that's like Tikal at Fantasyland in Germany, uh, if you didn't know already. And then, of course, you've got Buffalo Falls. So, you can see Storm Chaser Station right behind Buffalo Falls. So, you can clearly see that the queue line for, um, for Storm Chaser will go inside the bottom like level of the Buffalo Falls tower, I guess. So... Um, very interesting style to go with there. So there we go. So that is a look then at the map for this year for Poulton's Park. Obviously, I'll try and look at the rest of the map, see if I can spot anything else. Uh, and if I can spot anything else, maybe I'll do it in a future video. Um, of course, the overall look of Stall Chaser and the buildings behind it, it looks fantastic. Construction is coming along thick and fast. The pace of construction is coming along nicely. Any more construction updates, I will bring it to you here on the channel. And for now, guys, my name is Coach Chow. Please like the video if you loved it. Comment your thoughts and theories down below. Subscribe and click the notification bell so you never miss YouTube videos. Share the channel with your friends, family, and on social media. My name is Coach Chow. Kill the coast of life. And I'll see you guys in the next video up very, very soon. Take care. Have an awesome day, friends.